guys welcome back to my channel my name is Sade if you don't know already welcome to a new vlog today is April 8th we are on the way to Long Beach right now we are in Tejon we're gonna stop and get some breakfast because we're a little bit hungover we did stay up until about 3 a.m. last night and drank and just had a splendid time right now we're gonna get some breakfast and we have a full weekend we have about three days that we're gonna be out here and i'm really excited because i love coming on family trips it's my favorite thing to do so let's go ahead and get it inside obviously you guys can see they're waiting for me so let's go okay we're very the house Shake black coffee? Why not? Shake black coffee. Very good. Very good. I know, look at my coffee. I can get more because I'm going to make sure. Mine's uh, all half and half. Yeah. Grandma, which There's color? There's sugar right there. What is that? It's for school, right? It's for the costume part. Sugar black coffee. Fix it. The water is right here. Excuse me. There you go. Every night looks every day up. Every day patches the night up. Oh God, you should match it. It's the kill. No one left us till I fuck my 28th up. 1998, my family had the act up. to the hotel y'all y'all seen the view we got the view we got the upgraded room we doing the damn thing okay but now we're gonna go to the pier to go on a boat ride and then we're gonna probably go have dinner at the place that we've been going to for years it's the san pedro fish market if you don't know now you know they have the best shrimp platters ever ever hands down ever so we're gonna go do that and probably see what else we can get into for the night. So I'll see you guys when we get to the pier. Okay, my round one. Okay, don't round two. Close those doors. Okay. 
Hey guys, so we just got done eating dinner. Obviously, you guys seen that we had sushi. Today's kind of been a weird day. We were supposed to go to San Pedro to go um, eat the shrimp platter. They were closed. And then, come to find out, they have a new location. So I called the new location and they, they had like a two hour wait. So we ended up just not even staying and left came to the sushi restaurant and yeah today's just been a really really weird day nothing kind of has been going as planned so well, even though we just ate we're ordering pizza right now my dad went to the convenience store to get us some goodies so we're just waiting for our pizza to be ready and then we're gonna go back to the hotel and spend the rest of the day in the hotel because today has not <laughs> today's not been it we're back to the hotel y'all i'm so tired we walked so much today I know I said when I came back, I was gonna take a shower and go to bed. Um, my nephew wants to get some stuff from the store downstairs. So that's what we're gonna do. Maybe I might get some hot Cheetos or something. Probably take a tour, a little, you know, a little quick tour of the hotel. So when I get back, I am gonna take a shower and stuff like that. But we're all kind of feeling sick, which is so weird. I feel sick. He feels sick, my dad feels sick, my mom has a runny nose, so we kind of, yeah, it's a little bit weird. You guys, this store is actually so cute. It's very aesthetically pleasing. Everything is so nice and neat. There's no cashier in here. You guys pay, or we pay on um, these little machines, but it's super, super aesthetically pleasing. And I'm ready to go to bed and I'm gonna go to bed so good night guys and I will see you guys tomorrow morning when we wake up hey guys good morning it's the next day I woke up sick um, I don't know what is going on or what happened but I woke up sick I feel good I just have like a runny nose like a head cold I guess you can say but we're getting ready to check out and we're waiting for the bellhop guys to come up to get our luggage. We're gonna go, we're gonna leave, but we don't have no plans for the rest of the day. We're just kind of going, you know, with the flow and we're gonna see what we can get into. But it is Easter, so happy Easter to you all. I don't know if there's gonna be too many things open because it is Easter, but I guess we'll wait and see. It's been a really weird trip, you know. We're just, we're dealing with it. We're going with the flow. So let me show you guys the view. Okay. And we also got, somebody can do a breakfast here at the hotel. I'm just eating pancakes and bacon, but. I fell in love with it in me. Can't allow me your double bin in me. I should have learned my lesson then. I didn't want to keep going, I was hesitant. I'm to hit no other evidence. No, I'm going trust myself, ain't no better than. Better than really too tall like the president. And it ain't been no back and forth ever since. I kept the world with no evidence. I pay my dues with like every scene. It's just I'm fresh as a peppermint. Riches they come, ain't no better man. All right, it go like a treasure chest. All right, it go like one leprechaun. All right, I got this shit with a magazine. Young nigga fly as a pelican. I treat my ball like they one to one. I treat these hoes like they one to one. I smoke your dog.
that? Yep. Ready. Finally something good. Cheers. Cheers. Bon appetit. So we're about to leave to go whale and dolphin watching. I'm excited. We do this every time we come down here. So hopefully we see some dolphins and whales and you know, all the other good stuff out there. Let's go. Hey guys, uh, welcome to a new day on the vlog. It is the next day after we came home from Long Beach. We ended up coming home early because obviously you guys can tell I got sick. I wasn't feeling good. We kind of just were all tired and burnt out. As you guys can see, my face is extremely sunburned. I just put fresh aloe vera all over my face, so my face is like super, super tight, but it burns so freaking bad. Like anything that touches my skin really burns, and even just doing my hair, like these little baby hairs and doing the line, really freaking hurts. Hopefully, like my skin doesn't start peeling like normal sunburns do. I've never been sunburned before, so I've never experienced this. And the burn is real. I I really am hoping that my skin doesn't start peeling. Actually, I had I think you well obviously you guys seen, but I had a middle part bun um, when I was on the boat, and now I have a middle part sunburn like. I have just a straight red line down my head that was sunburned. That even hurts to like, that's why I didn't do the middle part because it was so tender and I wanted to cover it, you know, cover, cover as most of it as I can. I was going to do a side part, but I didn't want to put hairspray and stuff on my forehead, you know, to swoop it. So I, I wanted my hair back. So I ended up doing like this little zigzag thing going on to cover my straight part. And the top of my ears are also sunburned. And yeah, I'm just going through it. Yesterday when we came home, we kind of, you know, still continued our family night. We watched about two movies, ate, just relaxed and chilled, you know. It was a long day and we were extremely exhausted. So I'm so happy to be back. This morning we woke up, uh, we had breakfast, and then I posted my bedroom uh, reset video, and then I finished editing. Uh, my vlog from last week and then I took a shower and now me and my nephew we're going to Camelot 
we're gonna go mini golfing and maybe go-kart racing I mean I am wearing a skirt so I don't know how far I'm gonna get with the go-kart racing but definitely I'm going mini golfing um, it is another hot day so I really packed on the aloe vera today hopefully you know it's I think it's well it says it's 88 right now so that's pretty freaking hot I don't know why I decided to go mini golfing but that's just what it is um, today's the last day of my vacation you know that I took off from work yeah y'all so we're gonna go to Camelot right now and then I will see you guys um, when I get there Welcome to a new day on the vlog. Today is April 14th. I decided that I am gonna try to start a new habit, aka going to the gym. I am not a gym girl. I said that in my last vlog. I hate the gym. I absolutely hate the gym. I just, I just don't like it. But, you know, I need to start taking care of my health more and getting more unfit i've been on a road of trying to gain weight and i've gained a little bit of weight probably about like 10 10 pounds i've gained and it's definitely going to my stomach area and that's obviously not where i wanted to go i am happy that i did gain weight but i'm not happy of where it went and i should have been in the gym but i know that it's a process and i'm definitely not i'm definitely not a patient person I don't like to wait for results. I just want to work out once and have a six pack. I'm gonna see how this is gonna go for me. I don't know. I, I have a really bad relationship with the gym. That's just all I have to say. I have a bad relationship with the gym. I don't go for long. I'll go for like two weeks straight and then, then after that I won't go anymore. So let's see where I can get and I encourage all you girlies to, if there's something that you want to do, just do it whether you like it or not just freaking do it before i go to the gym i am gonna eat because i guess working out with no food it kind of defeats the purpose of working out i am gonna get in and out i mean i don't know what else to get i could have i don't have any groceries at home either this is just gonna have to do i know it's not good food to eat but it's just what i gotta work with for today and probably after if i have enough time i will go to trader joe's to get a few things to eat for lunch t for today and tomorrow or dinner i mean and then after that i do have to go to work i will see you guys when i get to in and out i'm around the corner so i'll see you guys real quick So I'm done eating in and out and the gym is just not in the plans for me today. Oh my gosh, I'm so horrible. I just don't want to waste my time. It's okay, I guess it's not wasting my time, but I don't want to go to the gym when I have other things to do. I don't know if that's a good uh, plan, but that's just what it is. I really, really need a car wash. That's what I'm gonna do now. Instead of the gym, I'm gonna go get my car wash. I'm gonna still go to Trader Joe's because I need some things to eat for um, lunch at work or dinner at work, whatever you wanna call it. Maybe I might get some Starbucks. Yeah, this is, I know this is a horrible t decision not to go to the gym, but I just can't. I can't do it. I can't freaking do it. I get shy. I don't know how to work the machines. I don't know what workouts to even do. I know I'm making excuses and I can 
YouTube this shit but I get bad anxiety and I feel like even though that no one is watching me I feel like everybody's watching me it's just because I feel stupid like so I'm gonna just wait to go to the gym with my friend follow her lead hopefully there's no one at the car wash if there is a long line at the car wash then because I really really need to wash I have bird shit on my hood and I don't want to the paint I have dead bugs from when we came back from Long Beach all over my windshield so you guys could just imagine how bad I need a car wash and it's getting hotter so that means there's gonna be stains anyway guys so I'll see you guys at the car wash I'm rambling too much at this point so. hi how are you good I haven't been here in a minute yeah uh, after these ones find more Five more after these? Yeah, no. Sorry. sorry. It's okay. okay. Bye. Bye. How are you? Good man. Yeah, it's, it's, yeah it's I told so him I'll, I'll be here tomorrow at nine. Okay. Um, it's just that I'm short-handed today. I got two guys that didn't show up. Tomorrow might have enough people where everything's gonna be, be moving a lot faster. Okay, I'll be here tomorrow be then. Tomorrow. All, right, All right. Bye. <sighs> Is today just not a day for me? To be doing my errands like i literally am trying to be productive today god is like no you better relax there's no way you're gonna get a car wash there's no way you're gonna go to the gym the only thing you're gonna be able to do is just go eat in and out <sighs> so i guess now we're on the way to freaking tahoe joe or trader joe's oh my gosh you guys this is such a catastrophe today i swear to you i was trying to have a really really productive day and it just seems like no. Let me get started for you. Hi, can I do a strawberry acai? Yes. Or actually, let me try it with lemonade. And can you guys not put the fake strawberries? Oh, can I get the name? Shade. I guess I'm not getting a matcha today. I'm gonna get a refresher because it's a little warm outside. I'm really upset that today is also not going as planned. Um, I probably spelled your name like so wrong. How do you spell it? Um, S H A D A E. OMG, I got it right. No you way. You did? Oh my gosh, That's you're like crazy. the first person ever in my whole I life. I was literally <laughs> so like, oh my gosh, if I get it wrong, I'm gonna be embarrassed. But I was like, hopefully, it's just spelled the way it sounds. Yeah, yeah, definitely. That's like stop? a first. I'm so glad. I just, I mean, I hold it. Okay, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Have a good one. Thank no you. shots, fine. Thank, okay, you. Have a good one. thank you. She definitely did spell my name right. Yes, girl. Oh my god. I've never had it with lemonade. Lemonade makes it taste way better. Bring on the problems. Bring on the motherfucking problems. Guys, one thing about me, I'm a real mother West Coast baby. This beat doesn't come on and you don't feel the vibes through your bones. I'm doing this right now. I don't know why I'm so emotional today. 
so weird um i'm trying to have a really good day and it's just whatever i don't know why i'm emotional i just got off my period probably like a week ago so i really don't know why i'm crying for no i'm literally crying for no reason like what the fuck is going on but this is the realistic you know this is a realistic day for me i was thinking about the fact that i really want to have a good day and nothing has been going as planned i'm just super emotional and sensitive today i pretty much just want my day to get better yeah i don't know what just happens <laughs> this is clearly what a girl is life is like we cry for no reason and we so i didn't show it because you know i don't want to be rude but i ended up giving an old lady some flowers she looked like she wasn't having the best day um she had a neck brace on she's a really really old lady really old he was getting in the car with her husband so i just felt like i wanted to give her some flowers she was super nice thankful it just feels good to you know make someone's day i'm gonna get my car washed i'm gonna stop crying before i go in here and look crazy i just had a little emotional breakdown it's okay it's usual i just need to learn to let it out when i'm crying yeah anyway i'm gonna get this car wash and i'm gonna relax and chill the hell out <laughs> i'll see you guys in a bit Oh my gosh, it's very, very hot outside, but I just got done vacuuming the car and it looks so much better. I feel so good. When I have a clean car, I feel like I just got my nails done. I just got my lashes done. That's exactly how I feel, especially on a freaking Friday. Like, girl, I'm at the last spot, which is the bank. I need to pull some money out and that'll be it honestly after this i'm just gonna go home i need to put these groceries away and put these flowers in a vase but after i get done doing that i'm gonna go to work and then come home edit because i really need this vlog to be ready so i can start a new vlog okay guys so i just got back from trader joe's and i thought i was recording and i wasn't freaking recording and we ended up taking our immunity shots my mom took turmeric lemon coconut water and black pepper and mine is vitamin d and zinc so we ended up taking these i thought i was recording and i wasn't i recommend getting these from trader joe's i usually get them from target at target they're two for six dollars and at trader joe's they're 1.99 each so you can get three for six dollars so i got a bunch of these and i put them in the fridge but i can't believe i didn't freaking press record like what the fuck? And then I'm gonna take this to work today, which is just the celery juice. Like I showed you guys, I am I'm I got pomegranates. I'm also gonna take this to work and I'm gonna try these today. I'm gonna eat these for dinner at work since I work the evening shift. I'm gonna put my beautiful flowers that I bought myself in a vase right now, and then I'm gonna head out to work. So I'll see you guys later tonight when I get home. Why you bother me? Why you bother me? Why you bother me? Last time I checked, you were the one that left me in a room. Me in a room. You all I wrote. Like my side, I wrote. That's that most city, that side that you can't go around at night. Hey y'all, welcome to a new day on the vlog. Right now, me and my dad are gonna go to the swap meet. It's 9 a.m. and we decided to come to the swap meet, not to get nothing in particular, but just to come and look. And I usually come just to get food and eat and get a churro, but yeah, we're not doing too much. It's pretty packed here, so hopefully we can find a parking soon and get in ASAP. I love the swap meet. I love coming to the swap meet. If you don't know what a swap meet is, for those of you who just don't know, it's, how would you explain it, Dad? Outdoor uh, mall. Yeah, like where people come and they sell things. It's a lot of Mexicans, but there's other races that come too, but majority is Mexican, so I guess it's a Mexican thing. Yeah, people just come to sell things to make um, you know quick money and they will stay here all day or, or on the weekends. And they have food, 
they just saw a bunch of random things clothes electronics car things lawnmowers like used stuff new stuff so it's just a bunch of different random things and this is what me and my dad like to do on sunday mornings we haven't been in a while so today is gonna be our first time in what six months yep so let's go ahead and go inside so i can show you guys pretty much what it looks like you guys what I got and then we went to go eat some tacos I went home I played with my dog for a little bit I ended up taking a nap and now I'm up I'm on the way to work I'm super tired super tired as you guys know already if you can if you watch my all of my vlogs you guys know I'm not a morning person me waking up at 8 in the morning doing whatever we were doing I very sleepy I'm like half asleep right now driving to work thank god like I don't have a crazy job or anything like that but let me tell you guys what I got at the swap meet I've been looking to buy a steamer for a long time I've been wanting to buy one but I just haven't you know worked myself up enough to buy a hundred or a hundred and fifty dollar steamer so I found one at the swap meet for five five dollars yeah i got a steamer for five dollars and the guy didn't even know what it was didn't know if it worked or not i told my dad you know what it's only five dollars if it doesn't work at least it was only five dollars we took it home my dad couldn't wait to see if it worked or not plugged it in filled it up with water and it freaking worked so now i bought a steamer for five dollars and now i can steam my sheets and my bedding and whatever else i want to steam so i got that that's probably like the only thing that is like I got got because everything else we got a little bit of fruits and groceries and stuff like that not grocery groceries but like onions and um, pepinos we got stuff like that there and then I did if you guys do know what the swap meet and you guys go to the swap meet I don't know if, if I, your guys are swap meet or if you guys go to the swap meet that I go to um, they always have those little barking dogs they little they walk and they just like bark like ruff, ruff, ruff. Like, yeah. Well, I wa I've always wanted to get my dog one of those to see, like, how he would react with it. Because he, he loves toys, like, and especially if they move. Oh, my God. He goes crazy. I ended up buying two little doggies that move and bark. I took them home to him, and he broke them, like, in five minutes. I'm about to shred this bitch. And then my dad bought, like, some hats, some Nike hats. I like to go on sun some Sundays with my dad. I'm glad that I went. Now I'm going to go to work. You know, I got off at 10. It's two. It's going to be 2 o'clock right now. I'm going to end the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys like this vlog. I have spent a lot of family time, which is something that I really need. But thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure that you guys like, comment, and subscribe. I'm almost to my goal. Help me reach my goal. Like I said in this video, Video, have your friends subscribe have your mom subscribe your dad subscribe I need almost 40 subscribers to reach my thousand subscriber goal so please help me out I will see you guys in my next vlog bye